Good morning and welcome to week three of Lent. My name is the Reverend Sarah Jane Stevens and I'm priest in charge at Sullington and Thaken with Warminghurst parishes. We're just thinking this morning about the size of our world. What's, what is your view of life and the world at the moment? What can you see when you look around in your life? Do you still feel hemmed in by regulations, by fear of the virus, by the sadness of not seeing your friends and your family? Do you still feel fenced in, like you can't see the wood for the trees? Now recently, of course, there was an announcement that there is now a roadmap for coming out of lockdown. A way forward. But there are so many conditions that need to be filled before those dates can happen. I know some people are feeling that the more they think about the roadmap, the further restrained within this coronavirus pandemic they feel. But what I would like to suggest to you is that there is a way to open ground. That there is a way out. Maybe not physically but mentally and spiritually. We're promised in the Bible that God has a plan for our lives, that he has numbered every day that we will spend on this earth, that nothing passes God by and that nothing happens without his knowledge. And under that, security of knowledge and understanding, we are promised that God has a plan for our life, a plan to prosper us and to give us a future and a hope. There is life outside these restrictions and beyond the loneliness. And that life starts right now. There is life within the restrictions. There is life within the loneliness, the trials of Lent and the trials of right now still hold the freedom of God. Let me pray for you. Father God, I pray for my brothers and sisters now and I ask that you would make it very clear to them over the next few days that there is life, that there is hope, and that there is a future for them with you, even within the difficulties in our society right now. There is freedom in your love, there is warmth and there is companionship in your friendship. And I commit them to you now, Lord. I ask that you would help them see the way through. Amen. Do visit our church websites if you'd like to join us with any services. All the details on how to do that are there. God bless you. See you next week.